The whole neighborhood is one giant canvas for the world's best street artists. This is Wynwood, the place to be in Miami for artists and entrepreneurs like us. I'm Mally, and this is Valentina. We run a small gallery, manage artists, and provide advice to modern and contemporary art collectors. Looking at it now, it's hard to imagine what this place was like years ago, before the walls, doors, and shutters were transformed into some of the world's most magnificent street art. It's been called a museum of the streets, and the art didn't just brighten up the walls, it brought this neighborhood to life. It's what brought us here. Now, there are hundreds of businesses in more than 70 art galleries, museums, and private collections, <laughs> including us. People from all over the world flock here to places like the Bakehouse to admire the art, to study art, and of course, to create art. This is Crave Art. That's his artist's name. He's known as the Big Butt and Monkey Artist. He organized a group of local artists to work on this wall. He's been creating street art here since he was a kid and has murals all over town. One is outside Miami's first brewery. Yup, locally handcrafted beer by Lewis himself. Now this is real art. All this work really does make a starving artist. Good thing so many new restaurants and bars have popped up. They're all amazing and very creative. You're basically eating in a gallery. Panther Coffee is pretty much the heart of our neighborhood. They take coffee to the next level. It's all fair trade and roasted by hand. Right here at the coffee house. This is Zoelle. She's a local DJ and loves the scene here so much, she created this super cool app, the Wynwood Tour Guides. It tells you all about each of the walls, the galleries, and the artists. Wynwood is definitely something you need to check out. It's probably the only place you'll get inspired by staring at walls and watching paint dry.